what what prompted what caused the Anunnaki in 2024 BC to resort to the use of nuclear weapons? What <laughs> you know? What was the problem? And the problem was that Marduk said that the age of the bull, the age of Taurus, which was the age of Enlil, is ending, he said, and my age, the age of the Ram, the age of Arius, is beginning. He claimed that this is the correct zodiacal scale. So he said, around 2200 BC, the age of Enlil, the age of Taurus, has ended, and my age, the age of Arius, has begun. The others, and this is all in those texts, by the way, the others said to him, no, you are wrong, because don't go by some chart. Look at the heavens. In the heavens, on the first day of spring, we are still in the age of the bull. We are still in the age of Taurus. Why? Because the three, the three zodiacal constellations of the bull, of the ram, and of Pisces are not the same size. So, though Marduk claimed that his age has already begun, it was still observationally really in the heavens the age of still of Enlil, of his rivals, the Nurta, and so on. So this was such a bitter fight that uh, they resorted <coughs> to nuclear weapons uh, to deprive each other of the spaceport. Now there is another cylinder seal. Uh, it is a, at the Hermitage Museum in Russia. Uh, there's no doubt about its date. It's 2500 BC. And it shows, in my opinion, without doubt, an astronaut on the sixth planet, which is Mars, greeting an astronaut on the seventh planet, which is Earth. You remember, I asked you to keep it in mind, Earth and its moon. And between them, there is a spacecraft. So, a return of the Anunnaki with a stopover on Mars, one greeting the other, has occurred. And there is a date. There is a date on this cylinder seal. Do you see the date? Pisces. The age of Pisces. The age of Pisces. So does this mean that the return of the Anunnaki and the end of days with its 2160 year calculation will still come about this century? Maybe. Because. <laughs> because. There is a because, ladies and gentlemen. Because just at the place that in according to the New Testament is called Armageddon, where the final war will take place, a mosaic floor in the first church ever built in the Holy Land, in the time of Jesus, has on its floor, this the sign of Pisces. This was discovered two or three years ago at Armageddon, which really means in Hebrew Har Megiddo, the Mount of Megiddo, which is in Israel. Now, are all these omens? Or is it just a tale to tell you a day are I don't know. I believe that these are omens. <laughs>